This video is for a 2006 Fleetwood Discovery 20 or 37C. The unit has 11,000 miles on it, 11,500 miles on it. Just want to walk around the outside showing the condition of this unit. This unit has a full body paint. The paint, I don't know what if it shows up well or not. This is actually a cream color here on the side. It's just absolutely gorgeous unit. Payseras really do a great job. They have the, you know, the slide outs will come out, the storage comes out with the slide out. Really, Payseras does that on almost all their models. This does have a Weather Pro awning on it. It's a triple slide. Just want to go around the outside, showing the condition of this unit. It's really just in great shape all the way through. It's got slide topper awnings. Unit is sitting on a workhorse chassis, so it's got an 8.1 with an Allison transmission in it. Does have a driver's side door. A lot of units today don't do that. Uh, Pace Aero does that quite often. Has a newer front end. They changed the front end of this coach in 2004, so you know you can definitely tell a difference in the front end. Payshares, they really have a great reputation of making a quality product and it's, it's very prevalent when you walk inside. Um, you walk in, leather seats all the way through. Again, it's got the workhorse chassis. High definition TV, this does have a King Dome on top of it. The woodwork uh, in a Payshares is by far, you know, in my opinion, some of the best that you'll see. Um, they really do a great job of finishing the unit put nice fixtures all the way around just little amenities here and there like a coat rack up here I mean you know just just well thought out well planned come up in the front got a nice computer desk with a drawer here again just a well thought out coach does have a rear camera power leveling jacks this is a triple slide this unit uh, has uh, sleeping for six people, five to six people. You know, that is a fold out bed. Does have a recliner rocker here. Come over to the kitchen, and you do have, you know, pretty sizable kitchen here. It's got a three burner cooktop. Two burner, I'm sorry. Two burner cooktop, but they're large burners. Convection microwave. Go over to the refrigerator area here. It's a 12 cubic foot refrigerator. Does have an ice maker in it. Just a nice size refrigerator here. Um, going back to the, the sink area, it's got a huge sink. Nice, real deep uh, 10 inch, you know, I shouldn't say 10 inch, 8 inch uh, deep sinks on each side. Good quality, uh, you know, uh, uh, solid surface countertops. Lots of cabinetry all around. Very good looking, uh, you know, fixtures that they use all the way through the coach. Go down the hallway. You've got uh, dual blinds, day night blinds. We'll skip by the bathroom, go to the, the back here in the bedroom. It has a queen size bed. Lots of area here. There's at least three and a half feet in front of that bed, so a lot of room to move around. A lot of people don't don't look at that that closely, um, but you know, lots of room. You know, I'm I'm six four. You know, here I'll show you. I've got plenty of room over top of my head. I don't feel confined inside this unit. A lot of campers, you know, they have short ceilings, so you, my head is scraping the ceiling. I just was just in one today. I don't want to knock on it because we own it, but uh, I was in one today. The uh, the ceiling was really far down. I just thought, gosh, I. I, I for long-term ownership, I just don't think it would make people very happy. Cedar line closet, you know, here's the other thing. Here's a great example of, of a well thought out closet. This actually has room to put your clothes in there and not have to worry about turning them sideways to close the door. So that's nice. I don't know if you can see this or not. There's a little hopper back here for your dirty, dirty laundry and, and uh, uh, back shoe closet on the side here. 
come back down the hallway here has an enclosed bathroom you know this unit does have a, uh, a porcelain toilet uh, nice size shower it's not the biggest one out there but it's nice size solid surface countertops back here and in, in all your sinks some covers you know the, the reason why that's important is it gives you a lot of surface to, to, to lay things on and do do different things it's got a washer dryer combo unit back here this is kind of common uh, in most uh, Fleetwoods, a uh, dispenser for your soaps. Just little things like that all through the coach. Again, just good looking fixtures. They really use high quality fixtures inside all the Fleetwoods. Very impressive. Uh, this unit does have a fantastic fan back here in the bathroom. You know, nice size medicine cabinets. Both sides. Actually, there's three of them back here. So plenty of storage, you know, they're really thinking of storage. Again, little coat racks, just little things that I think a lot of people miss or they pass by when they're buying campers. You know, if you have any questions about this coach, please give me a call. My phone number is 888-310-7744. My name is Mike Simpkins. Be glad to answer any questions that you may have. My email address is mike at gtwrv.com. Or you can see us on the web, www.gtwrv.com. Give me a buzz.